Rich Squad guys, welcome back to the channel. So one and only Dominic Rich. If you're new, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Road to 10k is in full effect. Uruguay won. Saudi Arabia nil. I predicted four goals to nil for Uruguay, but Saudi Arabia came out with a better performance today. But it wasn't good enough at all. And Uruguay joined Russia as a second team into the round of 16 of the 2018 World Cup. Saudi Arabia and Egypt will go home. These two Arab nations weren't able to scrape a win nor a draw in their first two matches. They also join Morocco as another Arab nation who will pack their bags and go back home. So Arab nations haven't been doing well at the 2018 World Cup. The other one left, Tunisia. They lost their first game versus England and it's not looking good for the Arabic nations at all. So um, Uruguay, they didn't look good either. I'm not impressed with Uruguay in their first two matches, scraping one nil victories in both. You know, um, the first match versus Egypt, they, you know, they waited late. And in this match versus Saudi Arabia, it was only because of a goalkeeping error why this goal was scored. Saudi Arabia, they put on a better, better showing today. You know, remember they lost their first game, five goals to nil versus Russia. But Juan Antonio Pizzi, you know, give his men a talk. He made a four, I think, four changes and they, they did better. They did better. They threatened, but they weren't penetrative enough. They weren't inventive enough to trouble Muslera in the goal. Uruguay, they also made some of the recommended changes. You know, if you watch my preview video, I recommended that um, they make few changes in the midfield because I think the midfield was too young and they did. Carlos Sanchez came in, Christian Rodriguez came in and they, you know, brought creativity to the table and it paid off for Uruguay. Six scrappy points, but it's good enough to, to take them into the round of 16. But they need to come better than this in the round of 16 because they have to face one of Iran, Spain, or Portugal. And according to my prediction, I think they would meet either Spain or Portugal. Their final fixture in the group will be versus the host, Russia. And these two teams will be scrapping it out for the top spot. At this point, who would you prefer to play? As Uruguay, would you prefer to play Portugal or Spain? I think they will prefer to play Portugal. But as it stands right now, we don't know who is going to top Group B. But I actually think Spain is in the better position to top that group because, you know, if they defeat Iran and then they defeat Morocco in their final game, I think they might stand a better chance because, you know, Portugal... You never know what could happen with them in their final game versus Iran. So I'm going to still stick with my prediction. Spain, top, Spain tops Group B. Portugal coming second. You know, Uruguay. I, uh, I, I predicted Uruguay to top Group A. So it might be a Uruguay versus Portugal matchup in the round of 16. And it's going to be a Spain versus Russia. So... It's, it's gonna be, it, it's, it's really, really, really gonna be an exciting prospect in the round of 16. I can't wait for it. I really, really can't wait for it, you know. The, the group stage is getting a little, you know, drawn out right about now. I'm actually happy to see some teams being knocked out. Um, I'm not happy that your team is knocked out, but, you know, I'm just ready for the round of 16. I can't wait to see who's gonna win the World Cup already. Do you guys think we might get a ninth? winner or we will see one of the usuals brazil or even germany win back to back or who knows spain or france portugal i would love to see belgium win it you know that's my team but saudi arabia they go home and oscar tabarez and his team la celeste uruguay go through to the round of 16. cavani suarez they were okay you know, Suarez was a little better. He was clinical in the one big opportunity he got today. He put it in the back of the net and he, you know, brought home the goods W for Uruguay. 
Guys, what's your thoughts on this match? Let me know in the comment section down below. It wasn't the most exciting game to talk about. You know, Saudi Arabia, they came out with a better performance and they're looking good going into their last game versus Egypt, which will be a dead rubber. I just might do early predictions for those two matches, the Saudi Arabia versus Egypt and, you know, the Russia versus Uruguay. I might, might do early predictions. So, you know, I won't have to worry about that next week. But guys, what's your thoughts on this? If you're new to the channel, make sure you click the subscribe button let me know if i miss any talking points in the comment section down below i would also like to mention that the refereeing was very good in this match you know um unlike the one in the portugal versus morocco i want to touch on the referee and i want to give him you know you know um the props they deserve and i want to talk about them when they're bad also but guys don't forget to smash the thumbs up button let me know your thoughts down below share the video and until next time peace out Rich. School!